In a world gripped by rising temperatures, we in Southeast Asia stand at the front line of this global crisis. We are experiencing more intense, more frequent and more severe heat events, creating unprecedented conditions that are threatening our health, our lives and our livelihoods. We have always lived with the heat and humidity, so it's easy to think we are used to it. But as the heat intensifies, we must ask, are we truly prepared for what lies ahead? Our countries, provinces and homes are feeling the strain of increasing oppressive heat with schools closing, work disrupted and heat-related illnesses on the rise. The toll of chronic heat stress is also quietly impacting our health, productivity and mental well-being. The region's rapid urbanization and aging populations plus socio-economic disparities further amplify the impacts making this issue impossible to ignore. The time to act is now. This urgency has led to the creation of the Global Heat Health Information Network Southeast Asia Hub, a regional initiative of the Global Network which is spearheaded by the WHO WMO Joint Office for Climate and Health. Anchored at the Heat Resilience and Performance Centre at the National University of Singapore's Yong Lu Lin School of Medicine, the hub will be central to the region's transformative action. Our mission, to foster collaboration, accelerate knowledge sharing and catalyse evidence-based policy and action. By focusing on regional specific challenges and priorities to safeguard human health and well-being, we strive to prepare communities, protect populations and empower individuals to thrive in a Southeast Asian climate. Together as a region, this is our opportunity to build stronger, heat-resilient communities. For today, for tomorrow and for future generations, let us commit to face these challenges head-on and build a heat-resilient Southeast Asia that can thrive in face of this warming world. Together, Let's rise above the heat.